We're here in St. Louis at the Lump Brewery. This place was built in 1840 and closed in 1920, and it is now one of the coolest maker spaces I've ever seen. I'm John Biggs, and this is TechCrunch Makers. So we're here talking with Vince Shell of St. Louis Makes. Vince, you're in, you're, you're in the space here. So tell us about this place. This is amazing. Yeah, so uh, the Limp Brewery is a wonderful facility that is really trying to focus its resources on bringing new space, new raw space. So the architecture is top notch here. It's uh, historical, but I mean, some of the views here that you can get, you just can't get in other places. Mm -hmm. You can't make this happen again. We are trying to highlight this historical space for the repurpose of both making and uh, selling a product. Mm -hmm. St. Louis Makes is a nonprofit that is bringing some of the best resources to St. Louis to both product design companies and manufacturers and small production facilities alike. Mm -hmm. So what's great about the facility here that we're going to take a look at is um, the raw space that is available for both uh, artists and makers alike. Tell me a little bit about the history of this area. Well, this facility was a full functioning, one of the largest breweries actually in the country. Mm -hmm. Legend has it that there's tunnels that connects all of them underground. Uh, they also have uh, two full uh, building stories above, mm -hmm. I'd say about 30 feet below ground. Wow. That is functional space for the brewery at the time. So caverns for uh, natural refrigeration, mm -hmm. as well as passageways between, like I said, the buildings, as well as the mansions from the original owners of the facility. This area, this building here, used to be part of the shoe factory, is that right? Yeah, so the shoe factory came after the brewery, mm -hmm. and they were called the International Shoe Company. Yeah, so the International Shoe Company would bring shoes between different mm -hmm. levels and uh, during the manufacturing process. And to do that, they would use this shoe chute. Shoe chute. So they would send shoes down this. This is amazing. Wow, oh, howdy. Hey, so this is Colab, right? Yep, welcome to our studio. Howdy. A custom design and fabrication studio. We do mm -hmm. some product design as well. Most of my work incorporates some elements of digital design and digital fabrication. My background's in architecture mm -hmm. and fine art, and I have an Etsy shop as well. I'm always looking for interesting projects, mm -hmm. but I do a wide range of work. Today, like I said, we're doing a modification to some cabinet doors. This is, how many square feet is this? Uh, it's about 1,800. It looks like less because it's so sure, full of stuff. Sure. But uh, yeah, it's a combination of digital fabrication along with traditional fabrication. Mm -hmm. And then this is the CNC machine, which most of my projects come across that. Those are some products that I've designed. Those are pendant lights that I've been selling through Etsy. Very, very cool. And you have a great view out here, too. Yeah, it's fantastic. You can see the Mississippi River. So as we just saw, this place is really, really raw. Uh, what are you guys doing to get people in here? Yeah, so St. Louis Makes is, a, is an organization that's really a facilitator for uh, new product-based companies here in St. Louis. So for those companies that are interested in trying to find this raw space for new production, I'd encourage them to go to stlouismakes.org. There's a community-based event called Swap Beat that comes here about once a month. Mm -hmm. So I would encourage people that are interested just in the Limp Brewery facility and how wonderful it is to come take a look at Swap Beat. All right, so next time I come by, this whole place is gonna be filled with uh, makers and 3D printers and robots and all kinds of other crazy stuff. Robots right? are going to be ours. Promise? Uh, yeah, we got a lot of work to do, but we've taken a lot of great strides so far. All right, thanks a lot, Vince. All right, thank you. We're here at the Lemp Brewery, one of the most amazing spaces I've ever seen. This is TechCrunch Makers. Thanks for watching.